Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to be showing you how you can change your wallpaper on Windows 11. It's quite straightforward and there's some shortcuts to this, so let's jump right into it. So here we have our desktop and the first thing we want to do here is simply right click onto this empty desktop and go down to where it says personalize. If we click on personalize, it's going to give us all of our options right here. And as we can see, there's several different things that we can focus on. Okay, so we have background this basically lets you set a wallpaper for your uh, Windows 11 computer, whether that's laptop or desktop, etc. There's also things like color schemes and themes and dynamic lighting, lock screens and things like that. Um, but this particular video, we're just going to focus on the background image. If we go ahead and click on that, we can see here that there's a few different options. So to start with, we can personalize the background and they have got some preset images directly here uh, embedded into the actual installation of Microsoft Windows. And of course, we can click on any of these and it's going to change that background image for us um, as we kind of see fit. Okay, so lots of different options, lots of ones for you to kind of choose from. I personally prefer this one, so that's what I usually have selected. Now, of course, there are other ways to do this is browse photos directly, right? Okay, so you can browse photos uh, from your photo library uh, of your, your machine. You can download a photo from the internet maybe and include that if you wanted to. Of course, you can check a look and put something custom in like this one right here. So a holiday scene, for example. And um, of course, I prefer this one, so I usually keep it there. And of course, you've got different ways of looking at this. You've got to fill the screen. You could fit the screen. You could, of course, stretch it out. And of course, all of this changes the look and feel of the image on the actual screen. Now, personally, I really like the fit image here because it kind of fits nicely, but this particular monitor, it doesn't work very well because it is a 4K monitor. So I have gaps on both the right and the left hand side if I use the fit option. So I usually go with fill on some cases, unless my image is, of course, is designed for that particular area. Now, this, of course, is just pictures. We can change this a little bit further by choosing this drop down menu and choosing a solid color or a slideshow or a Windows spotlight. Okay, if we hit Windows Spotlight, I think is actually the default. And basically this goes through the customized uh, photos from Microsoft and it will change every single day. So you'll get a new image through Windows Spotlight, or you can have a slideshow if you wanted to add pictures uh, of your kind of like holidays that you've been on or uh, your children or whatever, you can also do that as well. Personally, I like to keep it to a solid picture and I like to choose this one right here as it's my kind of go-to. But all of that functionality comes under the personalization and background area when it comes to Windows 11. If you have found this update useful and informative, make sure to smash that like button for me guys. Really do appreciate that. Consider subscribing for more hints and tips.